Alright, Shalom. <clears throat> First, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Lecha Kodash. Double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone, and peace and blessings to the elect. As you can see before you, the article here, alright, this is, uh, says this is from uh, J uh, Morgan Stanley. Alright, they said that uh, a global recession within the, like, basically can happen within less than a year if Trump escalates trade war. Okay, <laughs> and then you know what? That's being realistic right there, right? So let's let's read the article and see what one more has to say. It says the worsening trade conflict between the world's two largest economies, the United States and China, could send the global economy into recession within three fiscal quarters. Research by let me see something. All right, it says the first quarter of the United States federal government fiscal year is October, November, and December. Q2 is January, February, and March. Q3 is April, May, and June. Okay, Q4 is July. All right, so it's it's basically it's basically the different quarters or like you could say seasons of the year. All right, dealing economic wise. So it says here, um, which will be about what nine months? You know, three quarters. It says uh, research. Um, Research by investment bank Morgan Stanley has found investors are generally of the view that the trade dispute could drag on for longer, but they appear to be overlooking its potential impact on the global macro outlook, said the bank's chief economist, uh, Chitan Ayaya. He noted that the outcome of the trade war at the moment is highly uncertain, but warned that if the U.S. follows through with 25% tariffs on the additional Chinese imports, we could end up in a recession in three quarters. All right, and low willing quicker than debt. <laughs> so it says, in such a, a pro, uh, prognosis alarmist, we think, uh, no, is such a prognosis alarmist, we think otherwise, the economist said. While policymakers are likely to act to stem the effects of a trade war, given the customary lag before policy measure, uh, measures impact real con economic activities, a downdraft in global growth appears inevitable, according to Morgan Stanley. On Saturday, China's tariffs targeting $60 billion of U.S. imports have taken effect as part of a tit-for-tat response to Washington's trade war. And if you notice, China really isn't hitting the U.S. back with as much as the U.S. is hitting them with. Okay, but guess what, man? Let them start doing that and see what happens. Okay, see, Trump is going to keep pushing and pushing and pushing. But there's only there's only so much you can push. You can you, you push somebody into a corner. There's nowhere else they can go but back at you. Okay. So it says over five thousand American products coming into China will now face a twenty five percent import tax instead of the usual ten percent. Beijing's actions uh, came in response to the U.S. U.S. tariff hike on two two hundred billion dollars in Chinese imports after bilateral talks seeking to avert a full blown trade war failed. The Chinese government released a white paper on Sunday accusing Washington of starting the trade war and of being an unreliable negotiating partner. The document warned that the dispute has global implications. Well, yeah, and you see China and Russia are now making deals. They're, 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 they're finding ways to uh, uh, trade and, 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 and uh, deal with a different currency, whether it be the Chinese currency, the yuan, okay, and they're shifting away from the dollar. Look at that. Killing the dollar softly, Chinese lobbies are seeing on yuan uh, use to expand economic influence. Okay, and and guess what? That's gonna affect the U.S. man because the value of the dollar keeps going down, and this trade war keeps intensifying. Okay. Oh look at that! U.S. China trade war could cost the global economy six billion dollars, and you just had the IMF come out and say that they need to settle this trade dispute because it's it's affecting the global economy. Okay. And guess what, man? It's gonna get worse and worse and worse each time that that they 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 try to piece it together. The outcome gets worse than before, because ultimately it's the Most High doing that, man. And guess what? He's about to he's about to set lit, light that fire up. Okay, this economy is done for, man. It's it's finished. It's finito. And these elites who are pulling the strings, they know that. Okay, behind the behind the scenes and all that, they know that because they're orchestrating it all. All right. And they're waiting for that right time to just 
you know what I mean, just just tell Trump to do something crazy, and then boom, okay, so yeah, we're, we're, we're right there, man, and here it is, you have, you have people that can actually see it, man, look, Morgan Stanley, okay, they coming out and saying this, because it gets to the point where you can't, you can't, you can only use damage control for so long, oh no, the economy is fine, the economy is doing great, dude, that's not how it's working, man, it's not, if you want to be real, and take the blanket off, turn on the lights, okay, and see if for what it really is, the economy isn't doing good. All right, it's 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 it's, it's at a halt, and it's about to reverse and go and go down down downside. Okay, and it's gonna go downside quick. All right, but you know this was just a quick economic update. Okay, and uh, hey man, we're just gonna keep looking out for more and more of these prophecies because yes, this is prophecy. Okay, and these things are happening, man. They are happening, and the closer and closer we get to that time, the the more evident and clearer it'll be. To even people who not in this truth, people in, in the world, they'll see it. They'll be like, oh, shoot. Damn, this economy really is about to collapse. Or, damn, this really is about to happen. You know? And then they're going to remember who, who was telling them that it was going to happen. But guess what, man? Very soon, we're not going to be out here telling you this. Okay? We're not going to be out here doing videos, breaking down what this means. Doing videos telling you uh, what's going to happen next. Doing videos showing... No, no, no. That, that day, the Lord is about to shut that, that all down very soon, man. We don't know exactly when, but we know it's very soon. And when that happens, man, we, we got the truth. We got the knowledge. <laughs> okay? You're the ones who are going to be in some some deep some deep trouble, man. Okay? So, Lord willing, this is edifying to the elect. I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, and Shalom.